Welcome to Infigyan, my dear friends. Today in this video, we'll be solving one very interesting question from algebra. Here we'll be solving one quartic equation x power 4 minus 2x cube minus 9x square plus 22x minus 7 equal to 0 for the real values of x. So let's get started. I will write our left hand side as a product of two quadratics as we have minus 7 as a constant we can write factors x square plus ax minus 1 times x square plus bx plus 7. Once we will multiply negative 1 with plus 7 we are going to get minus 7 as a constant. Now we will expand our LHS. x square times x square x power 4. Then we will collect the coefficient of x cube which will be a plus b. Then we will write coefficient of x square a b plus 6 times x square. Then we will write coefficient of x 7 a minus b times x minus 7 equal to 0. Now we are going to compare the coefficients from both the equations. a plus b must be equal to minus 2. a b plus 6 must be equal to minus 9. 7 a minus b must be equal to 22. So we can write here three equations. a plus b equal to negative 2. Second equation would be ab plus 6, this must be equal to negative 9. And third equation after comparing coefficient of x from both the sides, 7a minus b equal to 22. Now we have to solve this new system of equations for the value of a and b. So let me consider equation 1 and equation 3. I will write here equation 1 first a plus b equal to negative 2. Then we will write 7a minus b third equation equal to 22. Let us add both the equations. I will write here 1 plus 3. So plus b and minus b will be over. We will get 8a equal to 20. Now we will divide both sides by 8. We will get value of a 20 over 8. So we can cancel by 4. 5 over 2. Now we will use our first equation. a plus b equal to negative 2. So a is 5 over 2 plus b equal to negative 2. So b will come out negative 2 minus 5 over 2. So b will be minus 4 minus 5 minus 9 over 2. a is 5 over 2. b is minus 9 over 2. Now we will use our equation number 2. Equation number 2 was ab plus 6 equal to negative 9. Or I can write AB equal to negative 9, negative 6, negative 15. Now we have A and B known. So we will write here 5 over 2 times minus 9 over 2. Is this equal to negative 15? Let's check. Product will be minus 45 over 4, which is not equal to minus 15. So our assumption x square plus ax minus 1 times x square plus bx plus 7 is not possible, not true, not possible or not true. Now we will take second combination. So I will write here x square plus ax plus 1. And in second bracket, we will write x square plus bx 
minus 7 equal to 0. Again, we are going to multiply LHS brackets. So, x square times x square is x power 4 plus we will collect the coefficient of x cube which will be equal to a plus b times x cube. Then we will collect the coefficient of x square which is ab minus 6. So, we will write times x square. Then coefficient of x would be b minus 7a times x minus 7 equal to 0. Now we will compare coefficient of x cube. So, a plus b equal to minus 2. Let me write here our first equation a plus b equal to minus 2. Coefficient of x square would be compared. I will write here a b minus 6 equal to negative 9. Equation number 2. And once we will compare coefficient of x from both the equations, we can write our third equation b minus 7a equal to 22. Now I will subtract third equation from first one. So I will write here 1 minus 3. So we will write a minus of minus 7a. So we will write here. Let me write here a plus b equal to minus 2. Here we will write minus 7a plus b equal to 22. Now sign change will be there. Plus b minus b will be cancelled out. 1 plus 7 is 8. So, in LHS we will get 8a. In RHS we are going to get minus 24. Once we will divide both sides by 8, we are going to get a negative 3. Now, from first equation, I can write b will be equal to minus 2 minus a. Now, a is minus 3. So, we will write minus 2 minus of minus 3 plus 3. So, b will be equal to 1. a minus 3, b 1. Now, we can check our second equation here. a b should be equal to minus 9 plus 6 minus 3. Is it true? So, yes, a is minus 3, b is 1, product is minus 3, which is true minus 3 equal to minus 3. So, we have a negative 3, b 1, which we are going to apply here. And we will get x square minus 3x plus 1 times x square, b was 1. So, we will write plus x minus 7 equal to 0. Now, we will write x square minus 3x plus 1 equal to 0 using product 0 rule or x square plus x minus 7 equal to 0. So, we have to solve two quadratic equations. Let me use quadratic formula x equal to s per formula minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2 times a. As per our first quadratic equation, we will write here capital A coefficient of x square 1, capital B coefficient of x negative 3, capital C constant 1, x will be equal to Minus of minus 3, we can write plus 3, plus minus, square root of, minus 3 square, 9, minus 4 times 1 times 1, over 2 times 1, so we will write 2 in the denominator, which will give us 3 plus minus 9 minus 4, square root 5, over 2. So, we have two real x values, 3 plus root 5 over 2 and 3 minus root 5 over 2. So, we can write here x 1 comma 2. Now, we will be solving second quadratic equation x square plus x 
माइनस सेवन इक्वल टू जीरो एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस एक्स माइनस सेवन इक्वल टू जीरो हेयर कैपिटल ए इज कोफिशियंट ऑफ एक्स स्क्वायर वन B is coefficient of x one, C is constant negative seven. We will get x equal to minus b, so minus one plus minus square root of one square is one minus four ac will give us plus twenty eight over two times one is two. So we can write here x three comma four. Will be equal to minus one plus minus square root of twenty nine over two. So in total we have four real solutions. If I will write here x one comma two also, we can write three plus minus square root five over two. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. do not forget to like share and subscribe bye bye till next video good luck take care bye bye